20 years from now, you will be more disappointed by the things you didn't do than those you did. So throw off the bow lines. Sail away from safe harbor. Catch the wind in your sails. Explore. Dream. Discover. Mark Twain. It's a nice connection to the elements that you get when you come out sailing because you depend on them. You depend on nature in order to be able to drive the boat forward. We all have something in our lives that happens to us, an external event that, you know, sometimes can bring you into focus. Uh, and having a place like this to be out on the water, to enjoy nature and God's creation, it gives you a good bit of perspective as to how, how to live your life and what, what's important and taking the time to kind of calm down and get out where it's quiet. Medical scares tend to come out of nowhere in a lot of cases and they, they come as a surprise. And the ability to get through that relies on a lot of support from your family, from your church family, from your work family, from the communities around you. I thank God that here we are looking back on it and we're out sailing on a boat on Chesapeake Bay, enjoying his creation and enjoying uh, time to reflect and uh, to recenter. We think of coming out here as a bit of a retreat for our family, to get away from town, to uh, come out where it's quiet and just enjoy it. It's a retreat, it's a place for us to quiet down. Uh, so we, we named it Sanctuary, uh, and it is indeed our sanctuary out here in the Bay. Uh, we have time to be together, it's safe in a storm, um, and the kind of pun is, probably where you'll find us most Sundays in the uh, summertime. To reach the port of heaven, we must sail sometimes with the wind, and sometimes against it. But we must sail, and not drift, nor lie at anchor. Oliver Wendell Holmes, Sr.